Hi everybody, welcome to another episode of Fish Keeping Jamaica Rally here. So here I have actually filled my 60 gallon um, aquarium with water and I've noticed several things and it's not leaking by the way. It, the water is just in it for a few minutes. I'm going to have to quickly um, siphon out the water because I realized an issue with it. Now here you have a bow, right? I don't know if you can see it. Here you have a bow, right, in the glass in the middle. Um, I'm gonna have to strap this uh, tank because it is big. The glass needs a little bracing, so I'm gonna be putting a brace here and here. Hopefully, I can siphon it out before uh, it actually falls apart. So I'm gonna be doing that in short bit. This is just an update. It's not leaking, but I need to um, release the water quickly so as to ensure that it just doesn't fall apart and just splash out like that right uh, so this is just an update on my 60 gallon <laughs> so you might be laughing really actually made a big mistake i'm gonna be fixing this little puppy stay tuned yeah. Glass broke. I mean, the mold of repairing it. Went to the hardware. A new sheet of glass for my aquarium. Let's see how well it fits. So, less stressing than before. So I'm going to be placing the silicone you should remember that silicone hold best under pressure and I place the silicone on the wrong seams so I'm gonna have to wipe it off and it on the right side and these are just some of the common mistakes made by novice or noobs not intentional but it works out in my favor because this channel is about learning so This side is together. Now I'm gonna have to wipe off the side of this side. And then now I'm gonna have to apply some silicone at the side here. ensure the leaking is to a minimum now after both sides have been nicely silicone I now have to I now have the the task of ensuring that the the glass is well secured and not having a cramp. So I use tape. All this water is from incident in which you witnessed a few minutes ago so I quickly replace the glass but I not quickly clean the air A 
okay and then now what i've been doing is to actually apply some amount of silicone along the seam the tank the good thing about this project is current project right now is that i'm only doing one side take my finger and I wipe along the seams and he asks yourself why is it that what happened happened I did not remember to put uh, braces on my first I did not remember to put braces on my first time Braces are important as it helps to hold the pressure of the top of the water as the water is actually in I shall say as the water sits in the aquarium. Braces should help to prevent a reoccurrence of the rapid expansion that took place. This will sit here for a bit to dry. That's one braces, that's two braces. Here's the last braces in which I have to make for my tank. Probably the lighting or the quality of the video may not be up to my standard right now because I'm trying to do it before night really sets in so these braces are practically about uh three inches one is about three inches one is about uh two and a half inches thick a middle braces is a little bit thicker and um and it should hold well should in case i have any leakage remember i purchased two um tube of silicone so i use those should in case the need arrive for me to do extra work and oh yes i need to Use my tape, of course, put pressure on this glass so when they have been dried, it should be holding something very firm. Thank you very much for making a fish keep in Jamaica. Thank you for watching. Um, I hope you did not laugh. As the videos suggest, try not to laugh. Alright? Bye bye.
see you next week as i give you an update